everybody, this is Why Ask Why. It's your boy LB is now sponsored by BMTA. And uh, today we're going to talk about why be kind. First of all, I want to start off today's video with a little tidbit about me. A friend of mine told me I should probably you know, help people get to know me and be more honest with who I am as a person. So, so I'm going to try. And one of my th things that uh, my dad used to tell me before he passed away was there's no reason in getting angry. There's no reason in being mad or negative because it doesn't help anyone. It doesn't help you. It doesn't help anything else. And it doesn't help the situations that you're in. So what I wanted to talk about today is random acts of kindness um, and deliberate random acts of kindness. And that it's up to us to be able to create a culture that is nice to each other. Um, and for the sake of being nice to each other, you can want to get things in return. I, I believe in selfish giving. I give to others. I, I am nice to other people because I want it back to me. Like, who doesn't want someone saying thank you? Who doesn't want someone giving you things? Who doesn't want someone doing things for them when you need someone to help you? So I do my best to try to give things to people so that when I'm in need, when I need a smile, when I need a hug, when I need someone to cheer me up, there's someone there. You know, so I do these things um, every day of my life, all the time. And anyone who knows me you know, knows that uh, I care about my friends, I care about my family, and all I care about is, is doing that. So I challenge you, I challenge you out there to 10 acts of kindness a day. That can be giving a compliment to a stranger. Giving a compliment to someone you know. Listening to someone's story when you can see they're having a bad day and trying to find out a way to give them a smile. Because a lot of times all you need to do is talk about something just to be happy. So this world, especially in the turmoil we live in now with the presidential candidates and the wars in other countries, there's a lot of people being mean to each other. There's a lot of people that just don't care about other people. And speaking as a black person, to me, kindness has nothing to do with race. It has everything to do with personality. And if your personality is that of a person that wants kindness done to them, and to get it for you, you got to give it to them. So I challenge you. Get out there in the world. Every day you wake up and think of 10 things you can do. You know, whether it's taking someone out to lunch or doing something for somebody. You know, today, right before we shot this video, me and a friend of mine went to go get lunch. And I saw this young kid walks in. He gets himself some food. His collar's a little messed up. You gotta teach people. Teach our young people that how you dress, how you look when you go out means how people are gonna perceive you. So I told him to fix his collar. He's always gotta look straight. Then he sat down after saying thank you and he was very polite. He didn't look at me like, yo, oh man, what are you doing telling me how to dress? Like, look at you. I was wearing flip-flops, my Superman flip-flops. You may think that's corny, but I love them, so I don't care. But he didn't crack any jokes. He said, thank you. And he sat down. So we get something to drink. We're getting our, our drinks from our meals that we ordered. And I give him $3 and said, hey, I see you don't have anything to drink. You just ordered some food. Go get yourself something to drink. And I did that just because I wanted to do that. That made me feel good. My self-gratification. You want that instant gratification? Do something nice for someone because instantly you feel good. And that will always come back to you. I feel great about that. And I don't tell a lot of people I do things like that, but a good friend said, you should share the things that you do. So I'm sharing that one. I bought that guy something to drink and I gave him some, uh, some good advice. Talked to him about his school and made sure he kept his mind in a positive well. Wherever he's going, he's gonna smile, he's gonna tell somebody that story. And hopefully they take that and they do something nice. And then the world becomes a better place. That's what BMTA is all about. Be more than average, be kind. It's your boy LB is now. Thanks for watching. Deuces. Yo, again, I want to say thank you for watching. It's your boy LB is now BMTA. I want everybody to like, subscribe, leave a comment. It would be really kind of you if you left a comment. Let me know what you like, what you don't like, what would you like me to talk about, any opinions that you might want to find. Yo, like I said before, it's all about facts, it's all about being known. Right now, it's all about being kind. BMTA, the way it is now. Thank you.